Hi, you heartlings. HeartGamer26 here, and I am back with a brand new episode of AutoCraft. Yes, we are back. If you saw last week's episode, you know that we ended up finishing up the trial chambers with fellow AutoCrafters. And today's episode, we are going to be working on something completely different. But first, I have a lot I want to show you that happened within the past uh, few episodes, between the past few episodes. As you can see, a lot has changed around here. So first of all, I wanted to show off our lovely parrot. Uh, he is now in a cage and has a name. His name is Blooster. And I did a little bit of armor stand work. It's not the greatest, but it does. It gives the illusion that he's hanging in a little cage. We also moved our crops over here so we can uh, get them out of the way and have a bountiful harvest. Which, if we follow the path, which I have done, I also made it all the way to this island section of the shopping district that hopefully will happen eventually. But we also moved our lovely cows inside, so now they are war nice and safe and warm in their cute little barn, and hopefully the um, copper will oxidize. It's gonna take a while, but that's fine. Because, you know, far at least like barns have those copper uh, roofs, so that's kind of why I went with that. But, as well, we have some other stuff that we need to show off. Uh, if we come down here, I have added four new rooms. Uh, this is just ladders up to the where my storage is currently. But I've added four new rooms. Uh, this room is going to be where my bigger storage is and also my lovely uh, cocoa beans. If we come over here, directly across is going to be where my nether portal is. I'm hoping to connect this to the nether roof. We'll see if that actually happens. Um, if we come over here, this is where my brewing stuff is going to be. And even though they're hidden, if we go in here, I have some axolotls. We got a little snowdrop here. We got uh, sunshine. Um, where are you? Mud pie, who likes to be stuck there. And void. All there. The only one I'm missing is a blue axolotl, and uh, yeah, eventually I'll get one. But yeah, this is gonna be where my brew stuff is, and I'm gonna hopefully maybe add some more axolotls so we can actually see them. Uh, they're, they're not cooperating. But directly across from here is our enchanting setup. So we have a nice little enchanting area. Got my books. Uh, I added the amethyst so it has the nice little chimes to it where our enchanted books will go. Our lapis, our actual books, uh, and you may have noticed at the beginning of the episode, um, yeah, I'm sparkly. There's a reason if we look in it. I'm sparkly. I, my tools are sparkly. Yes, I am fully decked out with at least enchanted armor. It's diamond enchanted armor, but it's enchanted armor nonetheless. And as well, you may notice, I have a lovely set of wings. Yes, uh, Auto Gear was nice enough to gift me a pair of wings, so I don't have to go flying out to the to the end to do end busting. I mean, I might still do it, but I have now wings, and they're already fully enchanted. So I got my be my hat, my wings, my pants, my booties, and of course my different uh, tools. We need to figure out a name. I need to finish setting some of them up. They're not fully all set up, but I still have my lovely tools. And speaking of auto gear, we're gonna cut to uh, an interaction I had with auto gear the other day because uh, he's in the need of something. And that something involves one of my shops. So I'm going to cut to the clip. You guys will see that. And I'm going to meet you over at the shopping district because that's where we're going to have our, the rest or where we're going to do our main part of the episode. So I will see you all there. Hello. Okay. I Hello. thought I heard something. I thought it was a dying mosquito, but. Uh, you know, it's fine. It, it, I am everything. I am everywhere. <laughs> I, I don't know. I, what do hi. I have this pleasure of um, a visit? Uh, that's a great question. Uh, my presence. I don't know. Um, the uh, I I require I require something. Oh, uh, okay. I, what do you I, require? I I, I, I I might be able to give it to you. I I require an immense amount of slime. Oh, I can do that. I can definitely do that. I have a slime farm downstairs that works half the time. What seems to be the issue? Uh, the stupid hopper minecarts likes to like to stop randomly or jump tracks. 
Uh, um, I don't know if that's a thing they fixed, but it uh, minecarts used to stop moving after the chunks were unloaded. So I'm assuming uh... it's probably something to do with that. I don't know about switching tracks, but stopping, it's probably because you un like all the chunks are unloaded, no one's online. So this, the minecarts just stop moving. Um, that, that would make sense. I, I don't make farms normally, so I wouldn't ooh. know this type of information, I, but that would definitely make sense. I don't use many minecarts in farms, so I don't know either. <laughs> it's I had like, no other it's way been a long time since I've done that. I had no other way except to lays for my farm, so. Just, what do you mean? Just use a billion of lays. It's fine. Um, I don't have a lays. That's the problem. Uh, shh. It's fine. Okay, anyway, yeah. So uh, what, what I require is a uh, an entire shulker of slime blocks. Not blocks. balls, blocks. 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 I, need I can blocks. do that. It'll be some AFKing, but I can do that. Oh, okay. Uh, now, now I, have, I have another question. Uh, how soon can I achieve <laughs> Um, I could, tr within the next couple of days, does that work? I'd have to AFK. I have to see what I have for right now for slimes, uh, slimes, balls, and blocks. And then I would AFK for the rest of it. So within a few okay. days, hopefully. Is that okay? That that should that should that should be fine. I mean, um, I could always I... dip into my shop resources. No one's been buying any slimes, so uh, but I could dip into that if need be. I mean, like, I, I can run, I, to get myself my head start, uh, I'm just, I'll go over there and I'll, and I'll just, I'll, I'll snag, like, a stack or two just to give myself the start that I need. But, uh, mm -hmm. I, I will need an immense amount of slime. Okay, um, we can definitely do that. And, uh, yeah, that, that, that's basically, that, that's all I came here for. Uh, you're just useful to me and I'm, I'm using it. <laughs> I'm kidding. I mean, hey! <laughs> That's good. I'm I'm new here, so I I like being useful. So I'll take it. Ah! Uh, I still haven't. I'm trying to get them to weather a little bit, and they're not. So I know no okay. one's waxed it. Trust me, that All was right. the first I, thing I, I tried. I, I'm like, <laughs> who's being a troll? I tried. Tr trust me, that um, was the first thing in my head when half of it was already uh, weathered. So, <laughs> okay. As you can see, Auto Gear and I made an agreement. I'm gonna get him a shulker box worth of slime blocks. So that's gonna be a lot of fun, and uh, uh, that's a lot of slime. So I'm gonna have to do a lot of AFKing. But speaking of shops, I think it is time to for us to build up our second dairy shop, which is going to be based off of one of my favorite mobs in Minecraft, the lovely Axolotl. So yeah, we're gonna do a little axolotl shop and thanks to geobug's suggestion we're going to build it right here because the idea i have is we're going to build up a ice cream cart or a snow cone cart because this is whole this whole thing is supposed to be based off of the beachfront and we have the shuffleboard game right here and i mean what better thing to have on a the the boardwalk but an ice cream snow cone cart especially right here where if you're on a hot it's a hot day and you're playing watching your friends play the shuffleboard game and you're hungry you can come right up here and get yourself a nice cold ice cream and also you got the arcade right here of course you know little kids are going to come running out of the arcade and want some cold ice cream or you know run into the arcade with the ice cream and spilling it all over the machines Hopefully not. But yeah, we're going to build it right here. So we're going to jump into a quick time lapse of me building up my lovely shop. And yeah, I will show it off when we're done.
All right, so we are here. As you saw the time lapse, we'll, we'll get to that in a moment. But we're here back with the um, in the lush cave where our slime farm is. And I in did do something on stream the other day. And I made myself a little axolotl area where we can breed and have our axolotls grow and swim happily. And also where I can have my pickles if I want and all that fun stuff. But yeah, this is where our axolotls are. And over here is kind of what we're going to be doing for the the shops. So we're going to kind of name them after their like respective flavors. So we got ourselves, I put my shulker down. We got ourselves yellow, which is lemon. Are those not? Are some of these not yellow. Are you not yellow? Are you not yellow? Oh, you're yellow. I don't know why you... It's interesting. Are you not yellow? No, you're yellow too. I don't know why some of them are yellow and some of them aren't. Or taking it, but... We got yellow for lemon. We got brown, which is a chocolate. Um, personally, the uh, best flavor in my opinion. But, yeah. So we got that one. And then we got white, which is vanilla. You know, gotta have that... You're gonna have chocolate, you gotta have vanilla. So, uh, uh, uh oh. Now, now I'm getting to the point where it's like, okay, you're brown. You're brown. What are you? You're brown as well. Okay. Yeah, I wish, I wish they kind of showed the axolotls in the buckets, like what color they were. To put the two browns on our hot bar and assuming you're you're yellow. Okay, so that's yellow, so yellow's there. And that means last but not least, our lovely pink axolotls, which you know, is strawberry. So we have vanilla, chocolate, lemon, strawberry, and unfortunately we have not gotten any blue raspberry yet. So no blue axolotls yet. I am slowly working on that. But hopefully we can get that taken care of. But yeah, I did some light, a huge lighting up, uh, and like kind of filled in spots, even though I keep getting axolotls in here. So I'm, I'm good on axolotls. This is like the best place to get them. But I tried getting rid of as much water as I could to try to narrow down on the axolotl spawnage, but it is what it is. And so, yeah. We're gonna head back to the shop and we're gonna finish up there, get our sh stock in order and the prices set. So I will meet y'all there. All right, so we're gonna fill up our barrels. So these are the chocolate. I think the yellow will go here. So this is a brown or chocolate. Brown. I think I'll do one diamond each. Which will go all uh yeah, that's fine. Okay, so we'll have that one. This one's lemon, so we got lemon. That one is the yellow axolotl. And then we'll we'll do one diamond each for that one. Done. So the front one is going to be blue raspberry, raspberry, blue axolotl, coming, coming soon. Over here, we'll have, I think this is the pink one. Double check. Uh, yep, pink one. Okay. So we'll put pink here. Fully stock you. All right, we'll get strawberry. Pink axolotl. Uh, one diamond each. Right, and then last but not least, vanilla. One, oh, no, white, 
axolotl. One, one diamond each. There we go. Okay, cool. So they're all filled up. Uh, except for the unfortunate blue one, but that's fine. Uh, I think the bottom was... What one? Please don't... Okay. So this is the vanilla. And I think... Vanilla, and then... I think this one was yellow. Oh, that one's brown. Oh, no, no, no. Sir, get back here. Did I break something? No. I hope I didn't break anything. Uh, does not look like it. Okay. So, this is all chocolate. And lastly is... All lemon. Perfect. Cool. All right. Well, with that, the axolotl shop is fully open. So, yeah. I'm proud of it. I, I wanted to do an ice cream themed one. I'm, I'll am i probably change the colors to make them all match the, uh, like, what flavors they are. But, um, I like it. I, I think putting it out of the way is the better. Otherwise, I can move it to, like, I, I was debating on the center, but I, I kind of like it off, off. So anyway, I like it and I I think that's about it. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Um, hope you like the cute little axolotl uh, ice cream shop that we have now open. And there is a skeleton that just spawned right behind me. So I need to wrap this up. But anyway, thank you all for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Let me know what you guys thought about it in the comments down below. We'll have a lovely discussion about it. Just a quick uh, reminder. I might go live tomorrow over on Twitch. I don't know. I have some maintenance on our AC happening. So I may or may not be live. Uh, make sure to check Twitter or the Discord to find out if I am. And there was a new episode of Sky Vaults this week. So make sure to check that out over on the channel. Or on the channel. Over on the channel. Of course on the channel. Anyway, I'm getting flustered. I will see you all later. And until next time, friendlings. Uh, goodbye.